Welcome back everyone. In this video I'm going to tell you about the top 10 hacking tools in Kali Linux. It is part 2 of my previous video on top 10 hacking tools. Before we start, remember this video is only for educational purposes. Hacking someone without their consent is illegal. So our first tool is Villain. Villain is a Windows and Linux backdoor generator and multi-session handler that allows users to connect with sibling servers and share their backdoor sessions, handy for working as a team. Villain has a built-in auto-obfuscate payload function to assist users in bypassing antiviruses. As a result, payloads are undetected. The main idea behind the payloads generated by this tool is inherited from Hoax Shell. One could say that Villain is an evolved, steroid-induced version of it. Villain doesn't come pre-installed with Kali Linux, but you can install it with the following simple command. Next on my list is Sublister. Sublister is a Python tool designed to enumerate subdomains of websites using OSINT. It helps penetration testers and bug hunters collect and gather subdomains for the domain they are targeting. Sublister enumerates subdomains using many search engines such as Google, Yahoo, Bing, Baidu and Ask. Sublister also enumerates subdomains using Netcraft, VirusTotal, ThreatCrowd, DNS Dumpster and Reverse DNS. This tool doesn't come pre-installed with Kali Linux, but the following command can install it for you. Number three on our list is Nuclei. Nuclei is a fast and customizable vulnerability scanner. Nuclei tool is Golang language-based tool used to send requests across multiple targets based on Nuclei templates, leading to zero false positive or irrelevant results and provides fast scanning on various hosts. Nuclei templates projects provide a regular updates list to ready-to-use templates regularly. Nuclei offers to scan for various protocols, including DNS, HTTP, TCP, and many more. All kinds of security checks can be performed using Nuclei templates. It is available in Kali Linux Tools repo. You can install it by following simple command. Next on we have Routersploit. Similar to the Metasploit framework, the Routersploit framework is an open-source exploitation framework to exploit embedded devices, specifically routers by Threat9. Routersploit is a great tool to find exploits in those routers and IPCAM or CCTV. This tool can also be installed with the following command. Next, we have Seclists. Seclists is the security tester's companion. It's a collection of multiple types of lists used during security assessments, collected in one place. List types include usernames, passwords, URLs, sensitive data patterns, fuzzing payloads, web shells, and many more. The goal is to enable a security tester to pull this repository onto a new testing box and have access to every type of list that may be needed. This tool can also be installed with the following command. Next, we have Beef XSS. Beef is short for the Browser Exploitation Framework, it is a penetration testing tool that focuses on the web browser. Amid growing concerns about web-borne attacks against clients, including mobile clients, Beef allows the professional penetration tester to assess the actual security posture of a target environment by using client-side attack vectors. Unlike other security frameworks, Beef looks past the hardened network perimeter and client system and examines exploitability within the context of the one open door, the web browser. Beef will hook one or more web browsers and use them as beachheads for launching directed command modules and further attacks against the system from within the browser context. It comes pre-installed with Kali Linux. Number seven on our list is BetterCap. BetterCap is a powerful, easily extensible and portable framework written in Go, which aims to offer to security researchers red teamers and reverse engineers an easy-to-use, all-in-one solution with all the features they might possibly need for performing reconnaissance and attacking Wi-Fi networks, Bluetooth low-energy devices, wireless HID devices, and Ethernet networks. It comes pre-installed with Kali Linux, so you don't need to install it. The next tool on our list is Proxy Chains 4. Proxy Chains is a powerful tool that enables users to run any application through a proxy server. It is particularly useful for maintaining anonymity and bypassing network restrictions. In Kali Linux, proxy chains is commonly used for concealing the identity of the user during security assessments. I have also made a complete video on this topic. You can check it out by the link provided in the description or showing above. 
You can also install it by the following command. Number nine on our list is Crunch. Crunch is a word list generator where you can specify a standard character set or any set of characters to be used in generating the word lists. The word lists are created through the combination and permutation of a set of characters. You can determine the amount of characters and list size. This program supports numbers and symbols, upper and lower case characters separately, and Unicode. It comes pre-installed with Kaylee Linux. Last but not at least, we have Responder. Responder is a LLMNR, NBTNS and MDNS poisoner. This tool comes with built-in authentication server settings. In simple terms, this tool is used for sniffing and spoofing the passwords, usernames and OS and service version, etc. The tool contains various built-in servers, like HTTP, SMB, LDAP, DCE, RPC, Auth server. This tool also comes pre-installed with Kali Linux. All right, everyone, that's it for today. If you found the video useful, please have a subscribe and don't forget to smash the like button. Your like means a lot.